Hello there. Well, I just uh, created this recording and got it uploaded to YouTube. And I'm about to add it to my site, so I figured, well, it's a good time to record a video on how to add a video to a WordPress uh, page or post. Okay? It works either way, the same way. So uh, here's my page, my uh, video that is, and this is the page where you're editing the various settings. And I uh, put in a title that's not just the file name. I changed it from being a file name. And wrote a description, put in some tags. In fact, there's another nice tag to add in there. Save the changes. I made it a how to and style category. And the privacy setting is public, meaning anyone can see it. And I changed it from the standard YouTube license to the Creative Commons attribution. So uh, I'm going to go ahead and copy everything that's in here and put that on my site since I've already taken the time to write it. No use writing it again. So uh, here we go. I hit enter and paste. So I used control C to copy it and control V as in Victor to paste it. Okay, so now I have that there. I'm going to go up here to the HTML tab and I'm going to click that, the one in orange right now. Because I have to paste in the embed code from YouTube into this section, not into the visual. Okay, it's really an important point because it won't work otherwise. So I've got my description. Let's go back up here and I'll save changes so it'll be happy. And view on the video page. Let's stop it from playing back. There we are. Scroll down a bit to where you can see the share button. Click that. And then click on the embed button. I always use the old embed code by having this checked down here on the bottom. But you can use the iframe type. It seems to work. I just sometimes worry whether it's going to be backwards compatible with uh, all browsers. So I still use the old one. You, once you've got it up there, you just click in it once. It selects the whole thing. And then you can say copy by right clicking on there. Or you can do the control C for copy. So now I've got that code. It's got the size of the 560 by 315. You can go with bigger sizes depending on the layout of your page. Uh, sometimes I can get a 640 to work. You can also put in custom widths and it will calculate a height. Like I've used a 595 or 596. And you see it calculates what the height is going to be for you. So you don't have to be messing around with that. But uh, for right now, I'll just use the 560 by 315. Then you go over to your page, position the cursor, and paste in that code that you copied out of there, and hit update. And uh, that's pretty much all you need. This code pulls the video and the video player from YouTube and loads it into the browser and, uh, and displays it. So let's go ahead and view the page. And as you can see, peeking out of the bottom, there's your WordPress video. And it plays right from here just fine. You can change the size, the quality. You can go to YouTube and watch it. And um, it works quite fine. So, so there you go. Now, hopefully, I've made it easy that you will be comfortable yourself adding your own videos that you've uploaded to YouTube into your WordPress page. Notice when you click back to visual, it just shows kind of a placeholder. It doesn't show the video, but it does show the placeholder so that you can then click here and hit enter a couple of times to add more text. Okay. So, all right. I hope that's all you needed to know. If you have any questions, please let me know. All right. Take care now.